In this wayside cemetery, not far from Chestertown in the east central Adirondack Mountains, can be found many a grave of pioneers, heroes, and common folk whose toils and tribulations collectively made up the foundation of Adirondack history. But in one corner of this sacred place flies the flag of Ireland. This is the family plot of 20th century teacher, poet, world traveler, and Gibson girl model, Jeannie Robert Foster. The flag flutters over the grave of 20th century Irish painter, John Butler Yeats, father of world famous poet, William Butler Yeats. But how did John wind up buried in an Adirondack cemetery? Well, we have Jeannie Robert Foster to thank for that, for it was she when John Butler Yeats died in New York City in the early 1900s, who made room in her family plot when no one else stepped forward with the expenses of shipping the old man's remains back to Ireland. Today, John Butler Yeats rests for all eternity next to one of the Adirondacks' most talented poets, Jeannie Robert Foster, who proved to be as generous as she was talented. <laughs>